Greetings and welcome back to Polkus Plays XCOM 2. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come on, come back. Greetings and welcome to Polkus Plays XCOM 2, better and modded once again. Uh, it's been about a week now since my last recording session. Sorry about the break in between. I tried to record enough sessions, but eventually just didn't get around to it. Um, we're reading an UFO! Sweet. And oh my god, has the graphics improved over the last game. Look at that energy shield. Shimmers. Alien core. I'm hoping we can really pull some good stuff off this. Well, it's not just going to be a regular, um, you know, amount of stuff mission. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, let's get out there. Who are we going to send out first? Frederick moves out first, I think. See you, Feindliche Gruppe entdeckt. That's our first group. I have to neutralize all enemies, so I might as well start with the first group. Um, so let's get the over there. Good to go. Just here. Rolling out. Since we're going to be ambushing them, we'll take half cover. That should be okay. Now, nobody in this mission has their own stealth, do they? Ah, hold does. Course. It's been, like I said, it's been about a week, so. Pick me for Please my. Ah! Oh, I forgot. <laughs> so good. Oh, they've got armor, so let's start with an explosive. Most of them, I guess. Or incendiary. Let's go incendiary. This is for you. Incendiary. Resistance contacts had heard rumors Advent might be rolling out a heavy infantry armor system. Looks pretty tough. It does. Smack that target. Free shot. One down, thousands to go. We finish these guys off just with a series of shots. Should have taken a shot though. Like I said, it's gonna take me a bit to get back into the game. Did you see that? That's oh, okay. They're on to me. Let's go slice them up. Very good. Signal coming from the what? UFO. It's some kind of distress beacon. You need to get inside that ship and shut down the signal before they send their whole fleet after us. Oh shit. Okay. Eight turns until alien response. That probably means they're going to bomb it or something rather than just trying to land ships. So we should get out there. Oh, they even have the old classic doors. Oh, that's pretty cool. Rolling out. Got it, move it. Let's roll out Got regular it. like then. Moving. Come on! Running. Come on! Well, smash it, smash it. And see the damage? Not really. There's a window? Hmm. Alright, let's get into position. On the move. It is clear. Copy that. 
Not open the door. Yes. I'm going. Picking up movement. Alright. To be Luminator? Or not to be. I'm on it. Close. Not to be. Let's get Renus to Overwatch. Say we get the Ah, here's something. Three sectoids. And a snake lady. Open fire. What the fuck did I do wrong? You missed. Um. Tell you what, let's. Mm, okay. I can handle that. I'll can move to here. Throw a flesh bang over at these guys. You watching? Ding. I don't know. Six to eight damage. Unlikely to kill and you're know, kind of out of cover. Why is it showing Holtz out of cover? And bugs? Alright, uh, we'll just establish a kill zone like. Oh. Okay. Frederick, you can fall back. Position bestätigt. Three weird bugs with full cover. Executed! Oh my god! Oh. Thirty-three percent. Shut down, the grenade. Get yourself shut down. I'm under Tops. fire! Fire spreading! Standing at cut! Yeah! I'm getting cocked! Oh, that's on fire. Okay. That's not too much for them. Uh, let's get. Already there. Furnace around. Venice 1-5, yes, that's right. the distress beacon. Move in and disable it before the aliens get a bead on the UFO. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, should we fuss? No, it's not a little Damn it. Okay. In there and slash that one up. Nine damage, and yeah, okay, that's what I thought. <laughs> I finished it. Um, hope yeah, it's right, worth it. Let's move in. More damage. Hello, bye. Four damage. Big deal. Good man. Impressed yet? Yeah. Come on, do it now. And now they can move away. Is likely to be a newer variation of the Illyrium core driving the Avengers systems. Oh, what? Want me to take a hand Back in the fight! Carry that fire. Hold it. Seems doable. Wonder what happens if I hit it with a grenade? That's not even a grenade. Um. Grenade, uh. Alright, you need to get healed still. 
What's over there? August, kill up the Mikaneta. Settle down, you're fine. Down, you just settle down. Whatever you say. Let's hack the systems. I'll give her a spin. Okay, think of the activated. I'm in. We've knocked out the alien distress signal. Looks like the skies are quiet. I've got movement. Heads up. Yeah, I bet they're pissed about that. On your order. I wouldn't mind getting a closer look at their flight computer. Ours could probably use some updates. Nähere mich der Zielposition. Ah, we got contact on them. Let's have in there patrol over us. Well, no matter. Flashbang! Wie wär's mit Licht? What you gonna do, lost man? Kind of standing around here doing nothing. I can handle that. Hey, wow. Let's get August to mark him. All right, I'll go. Hey. Slice them up. All damage. That armor's tough. Let's go. We've got a backup swordsman. Deadly precision. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Go. Cool. Let's head home. Got our very own UFO. Now on. That's the first uh, UFO I've ever disabled. I finished the entire campaign and we never got to a UFO mission. Or at least I got to a UFO mission once and I had to skip it because I only had recruits and I didn't want to send them out yet. Let's try the uh, speed loading. Speed loading. Speed loading. Promotions all across the board. Poor Mukinator is injured. Promotions all across the board. Hidden ability uncovered! Yes! Makes the effort of the Advanced Warfare Center. This soldier has learned to combat ability outside of the area of special Bolt Volatile mix. 
The grenades have an increased radius of one tile and one little plus two damage. Interesting. Uh. Oh, it lets me redo the whole thing? Because of that? I guess? Alright. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Alright, so if I've got Volatile Mix, we've now got Grenades. Right, Master shows Inception, enemy struggle this. You gain possible and Dollage. Opportunity Mobility. Implacable. Conceal. Light Master. Shadow Strike, Blade Master, Seal, Implacable, Shadow Dash, Grenades. Lightning Reflexes. Each turn, the first reaction shot against you misses. Nice. Um, in that case. Hmm. She's going to be moving around a lot. And back and cover. Heavy ordnance. Actually, no, so it's sort of like tanking, I guess. So let's take that instead. Um, I should take on the CQB in training instead. Shotguns attack shred armor. Okay. Yeah. Take an action after dashing. Two health uh, total or plus six health per mission. We're taking nanobots. And Colonel Arenas Van Vershell, Engineer. Pulse rounds deal weapon damage plus 12 against dramatic enemies. Organic targets are immune. Does not stack with ammo, does not consume ammo. And has two uses per mission. Okay, so it's a special effect. Explosive rounds deal critical damage and rupture a target, making them take plus two damage from all further attacks. There's no stack with ammo, and we have two rounds. Okay, we're taking pulse rounds. Oh my god. Serial, a powerful chain shot ability. For every kill made with your SMG, your actions will be refunded. Damn! Then I guess... I'm gonna hold on to that. I'm gonna hold on to that. Uh, Pogus, additional planning grants this unit plus your health. Jesus Christ! Alright then, um... Mark target. Armor padding, definitely. So flight vest for plus two. Uh, armor padding for plus three. Um... Psych field medic. Covering fire. Run and gun. Free run and gun. Alright, um, in that case, I better change Rob Murray to a pistol here. And fire, lightning hands. Draw. Base off. Aim. No, it's the hands. Grenada. Overwatch shots can now be. By any any action, not just movement, but covering fire. Oh, oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> he got covering fire from the thing, but he already gets it anyway. Uh, oh well. Um. That's a free shot. I'll take it. Running gun, take an action after dashing. Implacable, if you skill one or more kills in your turn, you grant a single action. Personally. I think. Running gun. Alright. Damn. That was some good stuff. Frederick Wolfram has recovered. Let's go have a look at it.
if I change this to say shard gun, so now say shard gun for cereal. Yes! For every kill made with your main weapon, your action points are refunded. It has to be a shotgun. It's like so much more damage. Oh, we have to we have to load this thing with like so many abilities. Uh, I guess he's no longer a swords guy because we're going to be using his shotgun the most. Um, let's upgrade this beauty. We'll give him. Okay, advanced, 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 advanced. Advanced repeater? Yeah, it smells good. But... Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. Tag magazine? Yes. Advanced repeater? Yeah, we're checking it on. Check the advanced auto reader though. Oh boy! Phantom. Show step. Run and gun. Implacable. Just got a kill during your turn. Yep. Oh boy, he is going to be deadly. Oh. Such a practical crime. Yeah, I'll get to you when you get to you. Alright. We've got two more days of decryption. Let's get to it, people. Avenger Pal? Avenger Pal? Pal? New course. Okay. I'll take it. Anything to upgrade the adventure. Central, Commander, excellent. My analysis of the fragmented codex data is almost complete. The information I've uncovered so far outweighs the loss of the Shadow Chamber, as you'll see. Is that an elder? Haven't seen one in at least a decade. Yes, and I believe I now understand why. The elders appear to be afflicted with an aggressive form of tissue degeneration. Rapid muscular huh? atrophy, to a degree I had not even thought possible. So they're dying. Sounds like our job just got a whole lot easier. As with most things involving this adversary, it's never quite that simple. Why not? The elders have been aggressively searching for a cure to their condition for centuries. Each time they encountered a new species, they procured what genetic information and material they required and moved on to the next world. Until now. I believe they found something in us. Something important enough to cause them to take root. A cure? Not that I can determine. Several key files were previously deleted as part of something called the Avatar Directive. Avatar. We need those files. Were yeah. I to gain access to a fully functioning codex, I might be able to recover them. Or blow the entire ship to hell this time around. I didn't say I needed the creature here, Bradford. I am confident I could access the unit remotely, provided your soldiers can get close enough to it in the field without destroying it first. That we can arrange, Doctor. Another skull jack, huh? Alright. New objective added. Breach the alien network. I've updated our latest operational objectives, Commander. With time set aside to further an analyze the data fragments left over from our initial codex experiment, I finally managed to crack their code. The resulting data is perhaps more valuable and shocking than I had expected. I understand now that the codex was willing to sacrifice itself to protect this information. In the shadows, the alien overseers, known to us as the Elders, have continued to work in secret since the very beginnings of Advent. Although Central Officer Bradford tells me that no one has seen an Elder in the flesh for over a decade, I continue to see monuments in their likeness throughout the city centres. This is because they never left. I simply fell into the shadows, focusing their efforts on a more dire concern. The Elders are dying. 
Among the diverse and widely varied alien specimens we've encountered, the elders are uniquely afflicted by some form of rapid muscular degeneration. Their physical forms are no longer capable of containing the psionic energy that is the elders' lifeblood. Thus, as we've encountered these unique alien species in the field, at some point in the past, the elders encountered them as well, and used them in an attempt to cure this plague among their own kind. Unfortunately for them, and for us, it seems I've never found this cure. Now it appears they are looking to use humanity as their next candidate. I'll tell you. So now we finally know why the aliens are so interested in us. Any more projects? Yeah, we got a lot. Alright. Oh, no, these are the ones we've done. There's no challenge projects available. Alright, back to research. As expected, Commander. All weapons? Sure. I had fully expected to find that the aliens were conducting questionable experiments involving human captives at the black site we raided with the help of local resistance operatives. What we did find was something more reprehensible than I could have possibly imagined. A facility solely dedicated to the rendering and refinement of human genetic material on an industrial scale. Yes, the aliens that. have crossed the boundaries of known science. Consequences be damned. Commander, I don't think you'll find anyone on board this ship who feels the least bit sorry to hear the elders are dying off. If anything, morale probably got a boost once word spread outside of the senior staff. Of course, there's always a catch. They've always got a scheme. And I get the impression we're going to end up part of their cure, whether we like it or not. Hey, come on. Oh, yeah. Definitely. All right. More power. I do not think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. Really? You couldn't predict that we'd upgrade more of our weapons? The fact that we now have access to Gaul's weaponry that is both combat effective and safe to operate at these power levels is quite an achievement. Overall design relies on advanced miniaturization technologies developed by the aliens, which are, frankly, well beyond anything conceived of by the Earth's leading military development firms at the time of the invasion. Despite our limited capability for extended test firings on board the ship, our latest prototypes are already capable of consistently accelerating an adaptive alloy projectile to over 5,000 meters per second in a simulated environment. We're still preparing the final assessment, but it's likely a field deployable unit would have to be limited to a lower power threshold is the potential for ongoing strain to our troops when operating weapons. <laughs> <laughs> the gauze rifle, the sniper rifle, the mag cannon, heavy cannon, an instant event mech breakdown. 